Are you using organic marketing strategies where you are adding friends from Facebook group for a specific client, your ideal client manually, and you wish to outsource this to someone else? If let's say you do, you do not want to miss out this demo of this specific Google extension I'm using where you are able to automate the entire process, not only finding the right ideal clients based on the keywords that you set, but as well, automating the adding friends process for a specific Facebook, uh, Facebook group and also send them the first message that you already customized earlier. So if let's say you want to check out how am I doing so, you do not want to miss out this demo. Now, I'm going to demo to you guys one Google extension that absolutely automate the entire process from finding the right ideal clients from the Facebook group to sending them the first message that you can automate the entire process, all right? So if let's say you want to find out more about this Google extension, you can actually send me a, a Facebook message. I'm just going to put my Facebook message link uh, on the right-hand side. It is uh, my Facebook account is Joomlo Story, all right? So let's, us get started with using this Google extension, all right? Once you have installed this Google extension, this Google extension that is called Client Prospector will appear in your Google extension bar. So how it works is that I'm just going to demo to you guys how it works uh, specifically. So right now, when you want to use this Google extension, so I'm just going to take this Groove Funnel um, and, um, Facebook group as a, as a experiment to show you guys, right? So let's say right now, your ideal client, they are in one of the software, uh, one of the group of the software that you're using. It can be MailChimp, MailOnline, or it can be like group funnels. So I want you guys to go to the tab members that is called members. So once you put in the members, that's where you're able to activate this client um, prospect tab, right? So it will only, this tab will only appear when you are under the members tab or specific Facebook group because that's what we are going to do. We are going to add our members in the Facebook group. So there are a few settings right here and where the lookup intervals for the demo purpose, I'm just going to put 30 to 60 seconds. But if let's say you are in actual using this client perspective, I always advise to go for five minutes. The reason is that you do not want to look like a robot to Facebook because if let's say you do, Facebook is going to ban you, right? So that's why uh, always, if let's say you're using this for actual pick five minutes, but because I'm doing demo for this software, I just want to show you guys how awesome it is. I'm only picking 30 to 60 seconds, right? So next is that number of requests. How many friend requests you want to send every time you're on the extensions? And I love to put like 30, 30 friends I'm adding per day. And I'm just, I'm just going to pause this for a while. Uh, this is uh, something we don't have to learn right now, right? So the next thing is that we, want, we don't want to add anyone like Tom, Dick and Harry as our Facebook friends, right? And obviously you want to be able to, um, based on the keywords, the uh, clients are using, for example, you may want to add someone to, like, for example, you may, want, you may not want to add someone with who then call themselves athlete marketing because that's not your niche. Maybe your niche is someone who is a coach, right? Or who is a CEO. So therefore, my the keywords I'm using will be owner. So what it does is that based on the keywords that you're adding here, I'm adding CEO. Um, once I click CEO, I'll just press a comma. It will then add it, all right? I think owner, CEO, and director, let's say, all right? And then put comma. All right, you can put anything. Like let's say you are targeting at coaches, you can put coach, okay? If let's say you do not want it, you can just cross it, all right? Negative keywords is people that you don't want to add. Like I don't want to add affiliate marketers, so that's where I'm just going to put affiliate marketers and put comma, all right? So this message group is what I have already pre-customized in advance. So if let's say you have, I only customize one, okay? So definitely in each different Facebook group that you're joining, you want to be able to customize the uh, message. So right now, I'm just going to show you guys how I customize the message later on. But I just want to show you guys how cool it is to have this software automate for you. So let's pick Groove Outreach because I picked the Facebook group that is Groove Funnel, right? So right now, once everything is set up, so what I need, what you need to do right now is just to hit run. All right. So if let's say you can see here, there will be numbering over here. 
right? This number, how it actually land on this blue tag is here because they found that this person has a director, has a CEO. That is the reason why that they know that based on the keywords that they said, this is the right target. That's why right now, this blue tag means that they are sending a friend request. So I'm not going to click anything on my hand so that you guys can see that um, um, the process will be about, from my from my experiment, the process will take about one to two minutes to add the friends. So later on, what you guys are going to see is that the it will automatically op open up a new tab and sending the friend request and also sending the first message that we customized just now, okay? So meanwhile, just uh, take some rest, okay? Why am, why is it this software is going to take you some time to send the friend request? The reason is very simple. No matter you are sending the friend request manually or you're sending the friend request like, you know, uh, automatically, you want to make it slow. Can you guys see that? It automatically send the friend request. And when you send a friend request, it will actually open up a tab here. So let's click here. So this tab is the tab where they are going to the robot is going to help you to send the first message, right? So that's why they actually requested. So what this software is going to do is that they're going to search for the next person who is the owner based on the keywords that we said, okay? So back to the topic just now. Why is it taking time? The reason is very simple. You do not want to look like a robot, whether you are doing manually adding or like, you know, automatically adding. So right now, they also able to see CEO title here. So that's why um, this software is adding adding this person, okay? So meanwhile, let's just have a check here. Remember just now I told you guys, they are also going to automate the sending of messages. So that's how it's being automated for the entire process, like you guys are looking at it right now, all right? So that's why it is pretty, pretty simple to use. And um, what you can do right here, it's all the settings. So I'm gonna show you guys how cool is the setting, but I may need to stop right now. So let's see. So still sending message to same Rajput. I think the next message is going, we are going to add this person and then sending the first message. So let's check. So just now we actually sent to, let's see. All right, so far we only have sent one. Can you guys see the number? So let me search for this guy, Rajput. <laughs> All right, so let's see Rajput. All right, Rajput, we just sent to him. So that's why here over here, we show that this is the message that we automatically sent to him. So you guys know how it works, right? So I'm just going to pause this for the while, uh, pause the extension for the while to show you guys how, how to customize the specific message. So remember, if let's say you're using this extension to make it as five minutes interval, it's better to be safe rather than to like get Facebook to think that you're a robot and to input your keywords here. And a negative keywords means people who have a similar title that you don't want to add. Just add them here. All right, so right now I'm just going to teach you how to customize the message. Okay, so let me pause, uh, pause, uh, stop it for a while and let's refresh this tab, okay? When I refresh this tab, there is one thing that um, this client perspective, I'm opening a new tab, okay? This client perspective, I just want to show you guys how to customize it. You are going to see these dots on the right-hand side, so click on it. When you click on it, I want you guys to go to settings, all right? so. Let's go back, click the nine dot, and then go back to the settings, okay? So when you go to the settings, that is where you are able to customize the segments and group. All right, I want you guys to understand this. Segments is just like a sentence. Group is like a paragraph. So in order to send my message, I'm just going to customize two sentences. So the first sentence is called, that is called group funnel outreach. So let me customize. Uh, I'm just going to start fresh, okay? So when I when I usually customize, I will just put Aloha is always the, 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 the say hi I will actually use. And then you want to say hi to them for their first name. Meaning this software will automatically pick up their first name and then help you to type it. So that's why when I automatically send in the message, right? You don't see me type the name, but because we already done the setting, it's just like the email. I usually start with I'm June because I was born in June, all right? Um, I would say, I would tell them also where I meet them. We are both classmates. I always love to be like, just um, just be jokingly about that, okay? We are both classmates in Groove Funnel. 
you want to tell them how you meet them. So usually I will say, I will kickstart by saying, hey, my name, what, what is my name? And then where did we meet in Group Funnel Facebook groups, right? So Aloha, first name, I'm June because I was born in June. Um, I usually love to add true story because that's true story. <laughs> we are both classmates in Group Funnel's Facebook group. All right, right now I want you to click add. Once you have added this, I want you to click save mess message segments and then give it a name, all right? So this is group funnel outreach. The next thing is that usually you don't want to sound like a freak. You want to make people feel like, hey, not only I say hi to you, I tell you guys where I meet you and I ask you a questions. Otherwise, you're expecting to not getting any answer even though you say hi, right? So that's where um, what you can do is that I love to add another question. So this is what I've preset. So let me just delete it to show you guys how it works, okay? So, all right. I'm just going to start. Okay, the existing one I can't delete because I'm using it right now. So let me just create something that is called GF Content Tube. So let's click Add. And you can, you can just name anything, like the title that is something that's easy for you to recognize. I'll just put Content Tube so that you guys know that I'm creating this as fresh. Okay, so I will probably ask a question. So usually I will ask, how is there something going for them so far? And because I'm adding them from Group Funnel Facebook group, and of course I will ask that, how is Group Funnel working for you so far? Ask a question and you'll get an answer. So we can also customize by adding the name, but then I because I've already mentioned the name, I don't think I need to do so. So let me just click Add. Okay, and right now, this is the second paragraph, save message segments, right? So here you go. Remember I told you guys, segments is a paragraph, groups is like, oh, sorry, segments is like sentences, group is like paragraph. So I'm just going to connect the outreach and the content into these two sentences into one paragraph. So let's me go to creating a group. So I'm just going to create something that is called group outreach number two, okay? So let me add here, Groove Outreach 2. And this outreach have two parts. The first one, paragraph number one will be outreach. Sorry, not paragraph, sentence number one. <laughs> the sentence number two is going to be content two that I created just now. Once you have done that, just click Add and Save Message Group, all right? So, these are the detailed things. Don't worry, you can just always ask me unless you do not know how to do so. So let us try to start adding friends using the new script that I created, okay? So same thing. Remember when you want to open the tab of the client prospect, you need to go to the member segment of any Facebook group that you choose. Once you have on the member segments, just click on the client prospector and it will then appear all this. And all the message segments, uh, the sentence and paragraph, you can send it over the three, uh, nine dots here. So remember, if let's say you are using it, choose five minutes. And we have already set the keywords just now. And remember the message group that you want to pick because I have created a new one. So that's why I can pick the new one, all right? And then what you can do is just to hit run. So and the software, will based on the keywords that you set and ultimately adding friends for you, All right? So maybe you are every day targeting the same group, right? So you may not want to start from the number one all over again. Like you can see, this is number 66, but maybe today you already done all the searches up until like 100. You don't want the, this software to waste time from you for you to start from scratch again, right? So that is the reason why we have one extra function here that is called resume from last search. So if let's say you want to resume from yesterday's search because you're spending time adding friends in the same group, you can pick yes. And then index number, perhaps yesterday I have added up until like 105, which is this is what is being added right now. You can then start from 150, right? And then click on run, okay? So it is as simple as that. So this software is currently uh, automating adding friends to Sha, and yeah, it will then send a message to Sha later on. So it is as easy as ABC when you want to use this client prospector. And also there are also other functions that you guys can have a look and let me show you guys. And remember, if let's say you want to get the super duper uh, promotion prize from me, feel free to send me a message in my Facebook. It's called 
My Facebook is June Low Story. You probably see your icon here. <laughs> it's June Low Story. Uh, Facebook.com slash June Low Story, uh, where I'm highlighting over here. And just text me Clan Prospector, and I'm going to give you um, to know that how much is it to invest in order to get this ad. Okay. So I want to show you guys what other um, what other things that this uh, extension can do. So when I click this nine dot, remember what this is where you are able to customize your message in the settings part one thing when you hit over to settings there's three things that is very very cool where you can use so let's say you let's say you have been receiving friend requests from someone and you don't love it and you just want them to reply uh reply to you all right so when they send you a, a friend request so what you can do is that you can actually click on this tick and then customize a message like for example Someone send you a friend request. You can say something like, Hey, first name. I am not sure where we met, but feel free to let me know how we both meet. Or alternatively, alternatively, you can also download my, uh, my free ebook, like my free 30 day live video ideas at this link down below, right? So not only that, when people sending you a friend request, it's actually a time for you to do like business development and do marketing because this software is going to automatically help you to send all the messages as well as for the link that you want to send as well so send message when you accept a friend request you receive from someone like let, for example you have been receiving a lot of friend requests and after going through the friend request you want to approve certain people and usually as an organic marketer you want to be able to like send them a first message hey this is june um can you just tell me how we both meet so that we can add value to each other you don't want to manually do it, right? So that's the reason that we'll be taking this where you can customize the segment groups like what I taught you guys just now. And then this software will automatically send them, send them that, right? So same thing, once you have do this, you can click save. Um, and there's this thing, send message when you decline a friend request. Um, for example, you don't want to accept the person as a friend, but you also want to business development them like sending them a link so that they can actually get your free 30 day live video ideas that's where you can take so these are the extra functions with this client perspective so same thing because we are actually having a promotion prices right now so if let's say you want to know what is the investment fee to get this client perspective just remember to contact me and also or you can send me an email at hello i'm just going to put here hello at junlo.co yeah Hello at juno.co. All right. And also, if let's say you have been wanting to do Facebook Live anytime and anywhere, remember that you can actually go to, you can actually join our amazing video challenge. We can go to www.amazingchallenge.us where we are going to do seven videos in a week together. Right. So in these seven days, I'm going to give you daily coaching where every single day I'm going to coach you for live for 15 to 20 minutes and then after that i'm going to give you a video topic and ask you three questions and all you need to do in order to do a video is just by re answering to my three questions and record a video it's as simple as that and we are going to have tons of fun and you're going to meet a lot of new friends because you are not going to do it alone but we are going to be in a private facebook group and do this challenge record seven videos in seven days together so if let's say you are really have doubt feel free to check out our testimonial you can go to junlo.co testimonials with an S, right? Testimonial with an S. You can check out what our other challenges results. Like right? I have so far, I've already helped more than 100 stu 150 students to create seven videos in seven days. So you do not want to miss that. And of course, for client perspective, no worries. What you can do is just to send me a text and my Facebook, and I'm more than happy to let you know more details. All right, with that, I'll see you in the next video then. Take care. Bye.